Yeah, buddy. I'm back outside on this one. What's up, you soapy sudsuckers? It's Saturday. And that can only mean one thing. The day of the long run. I just wrapped up today's long run. Which really, in essence, wasn't much. The reason why it wasn't much, today is seven days. It's seven days from race day. Therefore, I'm officially starting my taper. Today's long run was five and a half miles. Just sunlight. You know we dress for the seasons. Right now it's about 36 degrees outside. I'm layered up. I got on tights, long johns, these windbreaking pants, long johns up top, and a nice Nike sweatshirt to keep my hair cut intact. Got me looking like a Blue Man Group's version of Kenny. I got no topic today. Um, I'm just excited. I'm lit up. I'm ready to go. I'm uh, filled with endorphins right now after my run. I'm looking forward to the future. Listen, you got to take your anticipation just like you take your anxiety, just like you take your depression and you face it head on. This time, two months ago, I was heading into a taper for the Torrington Road Race and I was filled with nerves. A uh, five mile race, I had done five miles plenty of times. But for some reason, I just like, I don't know, I was a wreck. But at this point right now, I feel incredible. I'm ready. I wish it was the 12th already, but it's not. I gotta go through a nice week of rest, um, dialing it back from 20, 29 miles down to, I think I gotta run 15 miles this week with two days of rest, which I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna spend half of those days doing yoga, I bet, just to keep myself loose and limber. I'm a workaholic, I love to just always be moving, always doing something. But it'll give me time to focus on some schoolwork, get some stuff done around the house. But I just wanted to share with you how excited and how pumped I am for this week coming up. So, so far I've raised $30 towards my fundraiser. I'd like to at least raise $75 by this time next week. Actually, scratch that. I think I can raise $70 in this next week that's ten dollars a day to put my total to at least a hundred dollars this is an organization that i feel very strongly about considering the work that i've done in my local soup kitchen if you have anything at all to spare a dollar 50 cents doesn't matter anything at all please click the link in the description and make a donation to the healing meals foundation they donate meals and food to families in the hartford and bloomfield area like I said, it's an organization that I believe because of the negative connotations that soup kitchens typically get. You know, it's not filled up with, it's not filled up with drunks or drug addicts. These are families who are dealing with the cost of living in such a way that they need help. And it takes a lot, it takes a lot to swallow your pride and go and find help somewhere. So I'd, I'd prefer to not leave these people empty handed. Everybody who makes a donation gets a shout out on my pages, just like Fen did, just like my cousin Pipes did. And they'll also receive a recipe for a healthy meal to get their meal plan kicked off right. Because around here we love to spread the health. Now it's Saturday, go watch some college football, get ready for the NFL tomorrow, and spread some love. Peace.